is you might find little baggies, you know, wrapped up baggies. It might be in uh, foil, it might be in plastic bags, whatever, leave it alone. Somebody might have dropped it on an accident, or they might have had to drop it real fast because of CO's. I don't ever smoke up, no I don't take shit. I got no love for the fake news. If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll always show up and make a statement. Hello everybody, hard to talk to prison here. Today we want to talk about the five things you should not do on the rec yard, especially if you're new. So do me a favor and hit that like and share, and if you're new, subscribe. Excuse me. Number one is do not walk behind people real close. You know, it makes them nervous. Do not do that. I've seen a lot of new people do that that was new to the prison and, and they're not meaning anything they're just walking and you know making laps or something and instead of going around somebody or something they, they get right behind them and just slow down themselves go around them and make a wide berth around them you don't want to get in their conversation you want to give them plenty of room you know you don't want to make them nervous by being close to them Number two is you might find little baggies, you know, wrapped up baggies. It might be in uh, foil, it might be in plastic bags, whatever, leave it alone. Somebody might have dropped it on an accident or they might have had to drop it real fast because of COs. And they may be coming back and looking for it. Most likely they will. Do not pick it up because it, if it comes back to you that you picked it up, you're in a lot of trouble. If you're new, do not, when they open the yard, don't run for the basketball court. Don't run for the weight pile or anything like that because, <laughs> I mean, if you've been there a while, you can. You know, you, you, after you've been established, you know, and been around a little bit, you can run for the basketball court if you play basketball. You can run for the weight pile. But when you're new, don't do that. Because somebody is going to run you off the court. Let's, let's say you run out to the basketball court and you're playing, you know, just by yourself. You're just shooting baskets or you're playing horse or something. I don't know what you're doing. And the guys who play there regularly come out there. They're going to get the ball and they're just going to start playing. You know, pretty much push you to the side. And then you're going to look, you know, you've been punked out. You know. Now, with the weights, <laughs> it's a little bit, don't run it because, you know, people are running up there to the weights all the time. People already know where they're going. People who've been there for a while, they know who's getting what, and you know, and they're, they're making a run for it. But let's say you're new and you run up there. Same thing in, on the basketball court. Somebody or a bunch of people may just kind of push you to the side and you start working out. You know, me and my workout partners never did that to new people. You know. If we got up there and they was like on a machine we wanted, weight machine we wanted, we'd say, hey, can we get this after you? Or sometimes, if, if I didn't have very many workout partners, just like me and one other, would say, hey, can we get in with you? And, and sometimes they end up being workout partners. But you don't, if you're new, you don't want to just do that. Number three is this. Don't, don't sit at, at benches, like especially metal benches. You know, most of them are metal, but don't be sitting at them, you know, if you're new. Because a lot of times, it's either somebody's, where they're hiding something in the ground, or it's where people, you know, a certain group hang out, you know. 
You need to get to feel things first before you start doing things like that. You know? I never did hang around where they was metal at. Benches, whatever. You know? Outside. Don't stare at people. I've seen so many new people. They do it in the wing too. They'll come outside their cell and they'll stand by their cell like this. And just look at people, you know, and stare at people. But out there on the yard, it's really bad. Like you see a group of people don't be staring at them. You know, uh, it's just not a good thing to do. But there's, new guys always do that. I mean, they, they go out in the wreck yard and they they don't know what to do sometimes, you know, which is understandable. If I was a new guy going to prison, I'd just go out there and start walking laps or something, you know. That's what I would do. Yeah, just act normal, you know, like you're, you've been there for a while and, and walk, you know, make laps or something. Don't be staring at groups of people or seeing what this person or that person's doing and uh you know because it's none of your business you know you want to kind of mind your own business anyway that's all i got for you now thank you for watching see you next time bye Search but you stay lost We are